Hi, my name is Roger Ahuja, and I'm going to take a moment to try to help you figure out why your internet connection may be running slow at times. Okay, so I'm going to pull up a command prompt, and once I have that up, I'm going to type in traceroute 4.2.2.2. And what we're basically trying to figure out is where the connection is slowing down. Um, so if we take a look at this, um, this gives me the my router address 192.168.2.1 and I actually happen to have two routers this 192.168.1.254 is a second router so I've got a router behind a router don't ask um, that's just the way I have it configured for a reason and basically as you can see the speeds here are seven milliseconds one millisecond and one millisecond now those are three different packets that were sent to that router and that's how long it took the router to respond back. Um, when you start getting more than like 150 milliseconds like this one over here shows 655 milliseconds uh, that's where you start seeing problems so over 150 is bad but this particular one is a single packet out of three and the others were fine um, so it doesn't really mean that there's a continuous problem so what you want to do is look at this and see if all three packets, and I would even run multiple trace routes, um, and if you get a continuous pattern, that would tell you that you're having a problem and where that problem lies. Now, you can't really control once you get out here. Um, this is all stuff out on, on the um, net. These are different servers on the net, and these are things that are beyond our control. So the only thing we can really focus on are probably the first two or three um, hops here which are going to be your internal network and that's really all we're worried about to see if the problem is caused by our internal network and if you see a problem there then you may have a bad router or a bad switch or but the problem is something that you can control and at that point you need to go at least you have a clue on where to address it and that's it